Hello my soccer universe. Well, viewers of my channel may know that I'm not the biggest fan of these guys, Bayer Leverkusen. Uh, even when they were about to clinch the championship, I think it was in 2000 or 99 or in 2002, um, even if it was at the expense of Bayern Munich, which is a team that in a way I like less because they're kind of the big boys, I was not really excited about that. In fact, Schadenfreude very often prevailed there as well. Uh, my teams in Germany have always been different ones. And you know, Leverkusen being in the region of Cologne, yes, FC, erst FC Köln was always among my favorite teams. So um, even when they had Austrians, I recognize they are a big quantity. They have one of the most solidly run football clubs in Germany. Have I never really, really, really liked them? That's just it. However, having said that, I think Xavi Alonso has changed something there. This Leverkusen team, that was the first time I was excited for watching Leverkusen. And yes, the one under uh, Christoph Daum and I'm under Topmüller, those were exciting sights. But this one had something about it. This one brought down the behemoth that is Bayern Munich. And for that, Bravo Bayer Leverkusen. Bravo Bayer Leverkusen. And doing it the way they did, like uh, not very expensive trend transfers, every transfer hitting. And also their playing style, which is not very, I would say, identifiable because the uh, players are more problem solvers than they are, uh, you know, uh, bound to a system. This is hugely exciting what's happening in Leverkusen. And that team really had me excited. Let's, let's put it that way. And them winning the championship even better so. And uh, a few years ago I said it's finally time to get a Leverkusen shirt. I got this Jakko shirt, I uh, think from the 18, 19 or 19, 20 season. I uh, put it down here. Uh, because for me Leverkusen always played in red. However, now they win the championship in a black jersey and they also had a really, really nice white away jersey. So I had my feelers out. I said, I guess I need to get another Leverkusen jersey. On the evening they clinched, I had one on Wilhelm squarely in sight. And here it is. Another Leverkusen jersey. Uh, was sent in a, just a pure laptop <laughs> uh, envelope here. It's even a little bit broken. Let's open it up. I actually do like this jersey. Even though I'm not a huge Leverkusen fan, I actually really like this jersey, the way it looks. I uh, had already opened it up. I think I paid 32 euros for it. Yeah, would have preferred to pay a little bit less. But there you go. Let's get it out. It's this one from the 10-11 season where Characteristically, they finished in second place behind Dortmund. Uh, it's also a design that is very, very similar to the current one. Now they have the cross, here they have the sash. I prefer the sash. I also prefer that we have a full color crest right here. And yeah, maybe the only sore spot is probably the sponsor. That can be better. On the back, of course, it says Werkself, which means Factory 11, which is their nickname. There you go, second Leverkusen jersey, kind of as a counterpart to this one. I mean, I really liked when Lever Leverkusen did it for a while that they released, say, a red home jersey, uh, which was then the away jersey for the next season, and they released a black home jersey, and they were switching around. But as of late, there's not so much switching happening anymore. But I think to me, these are now the two classic colors. And I guess with them winning the championship in black, I think black will become now the more dominant one. I still, when I grew up in the 90s, Leverkusen was always playing in red. So seeing them in black still looks a little bit weird, but I guess it's a trendy color. And there you go. What I like on this one especially is the color, which is kind of this floppy color. It actually looks quite, quite, quite nice and, you know, as a Milan fan, the color scheme will always please me. So there you go. In any case, again, congratulations Leverkusen, you did great this season. 
maybe but you know i don't want to over overdo it but you know here's a someone who doesn't like buy and has four buy and churches in, in their collection maybe even five but i'm selling one so yeah um i have not two leverkusen jerseys but maybe the white one if i could find that one from this season that one looked really darn fine in any case let me know what you think about this jersey give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video I'll talk to you soon about more things in my soccer universe bye Hey there, I really hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, here are some videos and playlists that you may enjoy too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel and hit the little bell icon so you get notified whenever something happens in my soccer universe. And with that, have a wonderful day. Bye!